Hey, welcome to Duke's RV. I'm Duke, your video host, and today we're taking a look at the New Camp Tab 320, one of my personal favorites. Well-made RV, very functional, a lot of fun just to, to look at. This is a cool thing, and one of the things I like about it is up underneath it, there's not a lot of plumbing and stuff. It's got really good clearance, so you're not going to hit things if you take it off road a little bit. Uh, you can see that yellow right there, that yellow thing. That is a quick connect for your gas grill or gas appliance, whatever you have. So this one, it's got this luggage rack back here. The one next to it has an outdoor kitchen. I'll let you take a peek at that. We don't sell as many of these, but it is available. You have this outdoor kitchen with the fridge, the microwave, the two burner cooktop, all the same appliances that come on the inside. I'll be happy to show you that. But we're looking at this one today. They're both nice. I'd like either one of them. So you can see it's got uh, some nice alloy wheels. Out here on the door, there is a trash can that's removable right here. That's convenient. And then you have a little blind right here for your uh, window. And I'll show you how those windows work. This has the uh, Asdell siding. Uh, and that is a cool thing. It's non-organic materials on there. Up in the front, you have this aluminum platform here. You could mount a uh, generator or something else there. Uh, there is a little toolbox looking box here where you hold your propane and battery. This tongue, it's not a power tongue jack. I'm gonna show you just with, two, with, with my little finger. I'm using my little finger only. You can raise and lower this thing, just my little finger and my thumb. It's very light. It doesn't require any turning. Just do it with one finger here. You can see it's just real easy to turn, effortless. That's a low tongue weight. Worked real well on your Jeep or SUV. You're not going to be uh, putting a lot of tongue weight on there. A little wind out here, but I want to show you. This is the cassette toilet right here. That's what these have as a cassette toilet. So this comes out and you could dump it you could roll it and you can dump it in a dump station or a public restroom or when you get home you can dump it there so you don't have to necessarily go to a dump station i'm doing this with one hand but it's easy to put in here you just lock it in place so that is a thetford cassette toilet and then you just lock this door right here and you're all set pretty easy to operate there is the other side here. You got an outdoor shower. Sorry about the wind. I'm going to get out of it. There's an antenna right there. So let's go ahead and take a look at the inside of this cool looking trailer. One of my favorite RVs. I like got a lot of favorites, but this one is really a favorite of mine. I really enjoy this particular brand and this model. It's very functional. So we'll take a little panoramic view here. Now that's a spare tire. It's not going to normally be mounted there just resting there you have this table that moves around it's got my contact information I'm Duke but this will turn all around it's very convenient you've got these uh, sort of airline style cabinets high quality solid wood stereo speakers reading lights but there's so I said I was gonna do a panoramic view that wasn't very panoramic all right let's go I'm going to try to win the award for cinematography in an amateur video. And I will uh, be happy to give my speech to the Motion Picture Academy. All right, so I think I went almost 360 degrees there. See down there, you got USB and 110 right there. And a uh, 12 volt also. 12 volt, USB, 110. And uh, there is your fuse panel right there. That is your uh, CO2... Uh, detector and then you have a TV on an arm you could swing that out no problem there's a microwave up there nice uh, go, keep my fingers out of the screen sorry uh, the uh, that's a max air fantastic fan it might be a Dometic brand but it is a great fan that's a great feature to have look at this high quality wood in here so that's what you're looking at here solid wood stainless steel it's not built like most other RVs. Look at these uh, nice hinges here. This thing's not going to be falling down in a few years. It's going to hold up. This is solid and a very functional storage area there. There's not a bunch of plumbing hanging down in there. Let's take a look down here. Oh, yeah, more space down here. 
you've got a uh, 12 volt fridge with a small freezer so it's a small freezer but you can get a little small freezer bags and put some frozen blueberries and vegetables and bring that another thing about when you're out on the road it's kind of fun to go to a local grocery store out in the country or somewhere and just stop by as part of your uh, excursions you might be you know everybody thinks you're just going to be out hiking and canoeing or whatever you might do that I like to go kayaking I bring my kayak but it's nice in the middle of the day to go out somewhere, see the local area, check out a local grocery store as part of the local flavor. I think I said local three times. That's very localized. Check out that stainless steel suburban cooktop. So this, this doubles right here as a counter space and a backsplash. Stainless steel sink, solid wood, nice lines in here. This is a high quality rig, folks. This is, a, look at that, just nice little touch. Little cubby storage here, little storage here. Uh, with these this is not wasting that space it's nice to put some stuff up there maybe some spices or something you could put something up in here there is an area where you could store things away and it has these heater vents right here and air, there's your vents AC and heater vents here uh, it's got an AC it's got a heater and I'm gonna show you these windows real quick one thing I'm gonna before I do that let's take a look at the bathroom it's got that Thetford cassette toilet it's not a huge bathroom but it's way better than not having a bathroom it's a wet bath you can turn that so you might have to sit down in here I think you could be about like five foot two or something like that to stand up I don't want to lie I don't know the exact height but it's not very tall but you can take a shower you can take an outdoor shower you can brush your teeth of course you know what you could do there on the Thetford cassette toilet it's the C400 series in case you were curious about which series it is keep your toilet paper in there it's got a nice mirror but this is a very solid rig so this all makes into a bed those fold down right there flat so this makes into a big bed area you've got some uh, cabinet space right here you've got a stereo speaker on each side and a map light so there's one on the other side of our uh, spare tire passenger over here now I think we're going to take a look at the window so you have a couple of choices here you can black it out and deploy the screen either one or you could do half and half you could raise it up and have it partially blacked out and when you open it up that you can use the screen when you open it up so let's say you're out in the uh, outdoors I'm tightening this right here when you open this and then open this one over here it, it's already creating a draft I can feel it uh, but between this window that window and again you'll have the screen if you want to have that and this fan right here you could stay cool if it's if you're in a low humidity area uh, and really when you're sitting here and let's say instead of a freeway you're sitting here and it's America out in the someplace you want to be in the mountains the woods the lake wherever you are the birds are singing you hear the water this is like hitting the jackpot. You'll be here, you can hear it, you can see it, you can smell it. It's just it's a whole different feeling. You're gonna feel so good in this one. That's, I know that's how I feel in my RV. I get a, a endorphins released in my brain. I love it. It's a great feeling. That's why I'm here showing you this RV. Okay, I got my foot on the couch. Sorry about that. I was getting really relaxed here. But just trying to give you a feel for this one, what it's like in here. So this is easy to open close. These are European du style dual pane windows. So they, they're very well insulated. You're not going to worry about insulation on this one. You can heat it up or cool it down. No problem at all. So I'm going to go ahead and close this. And uh, we're getting the freeway ambiance right now. Maybe you like the sound of a freeway. That's your thing. No problem. So that is the kitchen area there. You've got that window there. And I showed you the door here uh, with this window that goes up and down in the trash can I think I showed you that it's where you put the fire extinguisher and I appreciate you viewing this video if you have any questions just send me a text or, or put them in the comments below if you're interested in shopping send me a text I'll be happy to help you and uh, we'll make sure that we treat you right there's no dealer prep fees there's no hidden fees you can stay on our campground for a couple days I'll be your video I'll be your personal concierge so you see that table there it'll mount right here also so you can mount a table outdoors 
if you want to it's easy to do so this is the tab 320 and my name is Duke and I appreciate you looking at it there's a solar panel up there she's got a solar charge controller this is a cool thing I hope you're doing great today I'm having fun out here on the freeway looking about look at this RV thinking about going on a camping trip you want a smaller one we got the tag we got bigger ones we got the 400s we got airstreams we got montanas cougars we got all kinds of rvs but right now it's the tag tab 320 by new camp a great rv say hey thanks a lot this one uses a two inch ball it's a smaller than the two and five eighths that a lot of them have we'll get you all set up you don't have to worry about that stabilizers on all four corners i think i told you that 